Both having been raised in the same small town, Chris and Jenna were aware of each other growing up. Or at least I know Chris was aware of Jenna. Jenna was a year older, so to us, she was the older girl that a lot of guys had a crush on. So when they first started dating, I thought, well, this ought to last right up until Jenna comes to her senses. But thank God she never did. And so here we are today, the first day in the most important chapter in both their lives. This isn't just a union between two great people, but it's a union between two great families. I think I speak for everyone in saying we wish them nothing less than a long and meaningful life together. And I look forward to seeing these two great families continue to grow together in the future. So little did we know many years ago when we would go to the Harrow Arena to watch Stephen play hockey and Connor that his family was there and there was always this lovely older sister who would show up to watch the games. We had no idea that she would one day be joining our family. Christopher Gordon, you are my 1111 wish, <laughs> my one in seven billion. I love everything about you. Yes, even your stubbornness and sometimes sassy attitude. <laughs> because even those things make you the loving, loyal, and kind man that you are. You are the bearings to my board, the combine to my harvest, my concert buddy, and my first round draft pick. Jenna, I promise to be patient with you and to always let you finish your sentences. <laughs> I will always let you be yourself and never force you to change into someone you're not or to drop and switch. I promise to be your blanket and your warm cup of tea during times of frustration and sadness. I promise to always put you first. I promise to respect you, show you constant grace, and be a loving wife who builds you up, encourages you, and believes in your dreams as if they were my own. I promise to never keep score during our marriage, unless the Leafs are playing the Oilers. <laughs> I promise to always choose love, even when it doesn't seem like an option. I promise to continue laughing at your dry dad jokes <laughs> and writing you love notes. I promise to always have dinner dates in the tractor with you when you're working those late farmer hours in the field. I promise to be your RTK auto steer to keep you within half an inch of the path to success and happiness. I promise to be patient with you as you spend countless hours on your fantasy hockey leagues. <laughs> I promise to be your home as you are mine. Jenna, I'm so excited to build the life of our dreams together and to follow through with all these promises I've made before you today. I, Nicole, by the virtue of the powers vested in me by the Marriage Act, do hereby pronounce you, Christopher, and Jenna to be married. You may kiss your bride. Back in the day, um, I always had a hunch that our families might come together. I, I didn't think it'd be this, maybe, I don't know, but um, I, regardless, regardless, it's happening. you to make so much noise that the neighbors complain, okay? The people of the hour, give it up for the bride and groom, Christopher and Jenna Brush! for 
you is unwavering. I choose you every day over and over without hesitation. All these things I vow to you today, tomorrow, and every day forward.